Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How to be your own registered agent. To consider being your own registered agent, it is crucial to understand the role and responsibilities associated with this position. A registered agent is an individual or organization appointed to receive important documents, such as legal notices, service of process, and official state communications on behalf of a business entity like an LLC or corporation. Requirements to be a registered agent. To be eligible to serve as your own registered agent, you must meet specific state requirements. Here are the key qualifications. You must be at least 18 years old. You must be a resident of the state where your business is incorporated or operates. You must have a physical address, not a P.O. box, in the state where your business is located. Availability and compliance. You must be available in person during normal business hours, typically 9 a.m. to 5 p.m., to receive service of process and other official documents. This ensures that you can promptly respond to any notifications from government entities or legal processes. State-specific rules. Each state has its own set of rules and regulations regarding registered agents. For example, in Virginia, only certain individuals, such as attorneys or corporate managers, can serve as registered agents. In Colorado, the individual must be at least 18 years old. Electing yourself as registered agent. To elect yourself as the registered agent, you need to list your name, registered agent address, and other required information on your LLC's formation documents when you file them. If your company already has a registered agent, you can file a form with the appropriate state agency to change it to yourself. Risks and considerations. Being your own registered agent comes with several risks and considerations. You must monitor mail sent by the Secretary of State's office and other government entities, which can be time-consuming and may lead to legal problems if not managed properly. Additionally, using your home address as the registered agent address can expose your personal information to the public and potentially lead to embarrassing situations if you are served legal documents in front of clients or employees. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.